So this is my nanai. That's me and my brother. This is my family. There's me and my wife, my brother, my mom, my dad, my nephew, my son, my niece, my daughter, my friend. This is my mother-in-law, my wife, and me. This is me, my mom, my dad, and my brother. This is my daughter, my niece, my wife, my friend. This is my daughter, my mother-in-law, my wife, my son, me, my niece, my mom, my grandmother, my nephew, my dad, and my brother. Let me see what else I can show you here. There's my daughter right there. She was a two, almost three at the time when this happened. My son, he was, uh, how old was he back then? I think he was uh, nine, eight or nine years old at the time. My niece, she's uh, she's like five or six at the time. Me, my bald head, my wife, my mom, my dad, my wife. They're looking at some trees. There's my daughter when she was three years old. She's a flower girl. There's my daughter. I think she had a little cake in her face there. <laughs> There's my wife. There's my wife and me. There's my wife and I. There's my wife and I. There's my wife and I. There's a reason why I'm showing you all these pictures of the day I got married. All these pictures here hanging in my hallway right here are all pictures of us the day I got married. And that day I got married, I've been married to this wonderful woman right here, this incredible woman, since July 5th, 2008. Yes, today is my anniversary. I've been married to this woman, this beautiful woman, for nine years. Sometimes I can't believe it's been nine years the time has flown by so much since we got married. We've been together for since 2002, I think, 2003. It's been a long time. But let me tell you one, one thing right now. My wife is my rock. She is my strength. She's the person who my backbone. She's truly, 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 truly my best friend. I love her more than anything else in this world. More than words can describe and more than anything I can say in this vlog, how much I love her. Um, you guys know the story of how I met her. I met her at a casino, Texas Station, after I played poker. And it was funny because when we first started dating, it was kind of weird because I just got off. I had been divorced from my first marriage for about a year. And I really didn't want to get into a relationship right away. So for like a year after I got divorced, I pretty much did my own thing. I played a lot of poker, worked, played a lot of poker and worked, and played a lot of poker and worked. And then when I met my wife, it was kind of organic. It was nothing, it just wasn't really expecting it. And then uh, we dated for a while. And I remember uh, we were like high school kids because we were like, every day after work, I would meet her. And, or she'd meet me and we'd be like high school kids, you know, just hanging out, watching TV or whatever. Just me and her doing our thing, being like, you know, you do your date. You, when you first initially date someone, you. 
you you uh, are infatuated, and then he turns to love after a while, and that's what happened with me. And I wanted to do this the right way because my first marriage, I only dated her, my first wife, for like um, I think six months before I got married. So I wanted to make sure that my wife was the one. So we actually dated. And lived together for about six years before we even got married. Before I knew that she was the one. And because I didn't want to do this again. I told myself if I got divorced again, I was in, I wasn't gonna get married no more. So I wanted to make sure that Tanya was the one for me. And I knew it I knew it right away, but I didn't want to um uh to go to another marriage like right away until I was really, really sure that my wife Tanya is the one. It turned out that she is. And we've been together ever since. And we've been through a lot of ups and downs in our relationship or in our relationship. A lot more ups than downs. I would say 80% ups, 20% downs. And the downs were like way back in the beginning of our relationship. Because now our relationship is very strong. I truly love her. I know she loves me. I know we're gonna to be together for the longest time, probably till death do us part, as they say, and I said in our wedding vows. Um, I mean, she, she is the only person who ever, she's the only woman that I've ever dated or been with that's gotten me, you know, gotten me. Cause I could be stubborn I can be hard-headed, but I'm a fun guy. I like to laugh. I like to have fun. I like to have jokes. And but when I'm when I get mad or angry or annoyed, she knows it, and she knows how to diffuse the anger and the 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 bad stuff about your boy Ronnie Bizzle. And she can, and I, you know, and that's sometimes I, I can get that way. I get honorary and. I get temperamental, but she knows how to diffuse like right away, and I'm I'm to the point right now where, <coughs> excuse me, where I wouldn't I don't know what to do if she wasn't in my life. I I can't imagine her not in my life now. That's how much I love her. That's how much she means to me. She's pretty much my. Or 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 we're uh, attached at the hip now. So, if anything would happen to her, or she, we weren't together, I'd be devastated. That's how much she means to me. I, I love her so 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 much. So, baby, I love you, and I'm hoping. That the first nine years of our marriage will be as strong. Well, I would say the, I'm hoping that we will live together, we'll be together for the rest of our lives, and nothing will stand in our way. Because I love you more than anything else in this world. I love you, and I just want to say happy anniversary to my wife, to my love. To my truly, true, 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 true best friend in life, Tanya Baltazar. <laughs>